Good morning. <clears throat> My name is Wendy. I'm so excited you're here with me today because I have some fun stuff to show you. And we're going to get started in just a second. Um, if you're watching this video after um, the live, then just know that <clears throat> you I'm no longer live anymore if you're watching this on YouTube. So, um, Please leave, feel me free to leave me a comment. I just won't be responding to it in a live manner. Also, I wanted to take a second to just share a few things that are coming up this week and talk about a couple things. So some of you have noticed that I haven't had a host code release this week, which normally I would, and I would have some free gift with purchase. And so I still am going to be having a really amazing promotion and awesome things, but I've just moved it to November 1st so that um, each month when you order for me, you know that if you're ordering in the month of November, you're going to get the gifts for November. If you're ordering in the month of December, you're getting the gifts for December <laughs> so that there's no confusion because I feel like that kind of created a little bit of confusion and I wanted to eliminate the confusion. So good morning. Good morning. So happy that you so many of you are joining me popping in here. So I wanted to do a quick update. So on November 1st, I am going to be doing a Facebook live. Um, talking about a few things. Um, I don't know if sister will be live with me this week. She's pretty sick. So um, she may not be here with me. And then I'm also going to um, <clears throat> be sharing with you the amazing tutorial bundle that's about to release from me. Um, I team up with five other demonstrators and we create a really cool tutorial bundle. I'm just gonna, sh I can't, I'm not allowed to actually show you anything yet except, do, 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 there's the, <laughs> there's the top and look at how many pages. It's so awesome. So anyway, it's an amazing tutorial and that's getting released November 1st and that will be free with purchase, but there's some other fun perks with that. I have decided that I will be doing some exclusive videos of some of the projects that are part of my tutorial bundle. So if you purchase the tutorial, or I'm sorry, if you purchase with me in the month of November, you're gonna get that tutorial bundle, plus you're going to get the exclusive videos. Um, so there's that. So stay tuned for that, plus some other fun stuff. The other thing I wanted to talk about, um, was shoot let me print it really quick um is my rewards program so hopefully you guys can still hear me while i'm printing this i meant to print it before we got started here but um i ran out of time story of my life so yes, everyone's saying feel better, sister. Yes, she's definitely majorly under the weather. And then I also had to take Truvy to the vet this morning. She's got something going on with one of her eyes. So for those of you that don't know, that's my puppy. And she um, she has a goopy eyeball. So she's at the vet. Ah, so many things. Okay, so here's the other thing I wanted to talk about that... Um, I feel so excited about and something that I feel like has not, um, I've not talked about it a lot. So this is my Loyal Stamper Rewards program. And basically it's super, super simple. Every time you place a $50 order with me or more, you write the amount of the order, the date, and the order number. And if you don't have the order number, that's okay. But the date is important so that I can look it up. And so for every 50 you spend, you get a punch mark. When you get eight punches, you get $40 in product completely free. You either mail this to me or you can take a picture of it and text it to me or you can email it to me. So let's say you decided to put in a $100 order. Then you would put $100 here and you would mark off two punches and put the date and the order number. Super, super simple. So then when you fill this up, you get to choose $40.
Sorry about that. I pay for the shipping and tax and everything. So you're going to get a, a completely free $40 order for me. Super big deal because you get to pick what you want for free. So it um, don't order $99. <laughs> don't order $149. Make sure you always go to that 50 mark so that you can get all the punches. Okay. So I wanted to share that. The Snowflake products are coming out on Thursday. These are the stamp sets that are going to be available. They are gorgeous. So anyway, I'll be back Thursday to share more of this stuff and talk about it more. So I wanted to quickly, before we get into our project here, show you this stuff that I got in the mail. I got this awesome congratulations card from my team member, Debbie. She sent me this because I hit $300,000 in career sales with Stampin' Up. So she made this beautiful card for me and sent it to me. I got this sweet thank, thank you card from Debbie as well um, because I sent her some gifts and goodies and rewards for doing so well this last Stampin' Up year with her business. And then I got this Happy Halloween card from my friend Chris, who's watching now. She's also on my team. And she sent this beautiful Halloween card. I love it. I love this girl, as you can see. So, and funny we're talking about Chris, because this is Chris's idea. So she, um, Chris is on our team, and every month she creates... Um, a project for us <clears throat> to make something fun and it's part of what we call our creative rally and she creates this beautiful PDF and uh, all the supplies and then the instructions and she creates these and then we all get to make one if you pay so if you're on my team you pay 10 bucks you get all this make and take goodies and you get to make the products with us it's fun okay or the projects. So I'm going to make this. So I've just stuffed some candy in this little box and I'm going to give these away this week since it's Halloween. And I've got a piece of eight by eight gorgeous grape cardstock here. And then I have a piece of seven and seven eighths by seven and seven eighths designer series paper. This is the toil and trouble designer series paper. And I am going to use my snail adhesive to adhere these both together really quick okay I know Marianne isn't it cute Marianne says she loves the toil and trouble paper I do too okay so there's those two put down together and then you need the envelope punch board. By the way, before we go any further, I do want to share with you all of the products that you need for these pro this project are listed in the description of this video, along with a link to my reward punch card so you can print that out and keep it. And in addition to that, there is um, a link to my website so that you can go there and get the the information for all of these. Okay, so we're going to score this and put it together. And um, there was something else I was going to tell you. I can't remember now. Okay, we're going to go ahead. So you're going to you're going to move your cardstock to the three and a quarter inch line, and you're going to score and punch. And then you're going to scooch it down to three and seven eighths. And score, whoops, score. <laughs> Did I score? I didn't score it right the last time. Good Lord. Okay, score and punch. Let me, let me go back. Three and quarter. There we go. Okay, then you're going to turn it and you're just going to use the lines that you've already created. Hopefully you can see these as a guide to you've got this little pointy thing that sticks out here on your envelope punch board. You want to line that little pointer up with the lines. So we're going to line it up with the first line and score. Line it up with the second line and score. And we're going to turn 
Yeah, I am. Deborah says, are you having some moments? I think she means blonde moments. I am because I'm kind of discombobulated this morning. We're just going to keep doing the same pattern while I tell you. So last night I noticed that Truvy, her eye was a little goopy and red. And I thought, well, she probably got into something. We'll see how it goes. And this morning it was worse. So I had to hurry and get her to the vet. And then sister is sick. And it's just like, you know, my Monday morning's a little thrown off. And then I had to go clean the deck by washing it with um, water. Like I had to spray it all off this morning and it was cold out there. So anyway, it... The door is installed. Everything's done on the outside of the house. I'm so excited because that means that hopefully we're not going to have any more dust and dirt. <laughs> okay, so there's that. And by the way, this punch board is a must have in your collection if you don't have one. They're $19.95, I think. I think that's the price. And they're super, super, super simple to use. All the instructions are right here. It's definitely a must have in your collection. Okay. The other thing I wanted to tell you about while I'm trimming out all these little corners, so that's our next step, we're going to trim out the corners, is I had a gal, her name is Amy, contact me about using her nail products. Um, <clears throat> they're called Color Street Nails. I'm sure some of you have heard of them. Anyway, they're basically like nail polish stickers, right? It's nail polish and you put it on and stuff and so I used them and that's what's on my fingernails right now really 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 went together well um you know went on well and everything but I do have to say I am that ch they chip a little on the ends now I'm sure some of that is that I need more practice um uh getting getting them on correctly because I only put on one set so I'm sure that that's a big part of it. So now we're just going to burnish all the edges of this. Um, that's a big part of it, is putting them on correctly. So I'm sure it takes a couple practices to get that down. So I, I wouldn't let that discourage you if you want to try them out. They stay on really well. Um, you can see I've got some peeling happening, but I've had them on for about four days, which is pretty good. Um, the only thing is they're not thick, so they don't prevent breakage. That is something you need to know. They're not like going to keep your nails super strong like a gel would. But yeah, I do like them and I would get them. I would like to have them on hand if I'm in a pinch, if I'm going to a party or you know what they'd be great for is traveling. You can have them in your bag when you're traveling so that if you're manicure your polish or whatever got messed up you could easily um switch them out and that they would be handy for that so anyway um if you're interested in getting them I do have her information linked on the description of this video because I thought I would give her a little shout out for sending me a couple free free sets to try out for her so um yeah if you want some then Grab, grab her link, her info. It's in the description of this video and you can, can purchase them from her. I think they're like $15 for a set. Okay, so I'm peeling off my tear and tape and I'm going to fold this over and smash it down. And that's like my background. And now I'm gonna put the rest of this together by just folding it all over. So we're going to start with adding some tear and tape here and here. And then I'm gonna need a piece of tear and tape here because this is going to be the piece that folds over. So I'm going to remove my backing and you do have to use tear and tape for this. This you cannot use uh, a regular adhesive. It's just it needs a really strong tape. Okay, so we're going to do that and then we're going to fold this guy over first. And what I what I like to do so that you don't get it pushed too far or not far enough is I just line up the bottom right here. 
and then kind of make sure that the bottom of this is lined up with the bottom of this. And then that pretty much keeps everything straight like it should be. And then same on this side. And I'm kind of looking to make sure I'm not pulling because you don't want to pull too far over and have this happen, right? So you kind of just have to look and, and make sure you're not pulling too hard. And Okay. All right. So I'm going to just kind of go in with my bone folder. And all I'm doing is pushing to kind of make sure all of that adheres. Okay, then I've got my little gray stitched circle here and I'm gonna add, I know this is a Halloween project and Halloween is in like two days, but you know, this was like one of those last minute, like, ooh, let's do some Halloween. And I had to tell you, these are gonna be so stinking cute for Christmas with Christmas paper. And then look what I got to put in them. Hot chocolate for Christmas. And I'll probably put a candy cane. Isn't that adorable? So that's what I'm gonna do with these for Christmas, but obviously with Christmas paper. So let's do a little stamping here on the top or on the front. And I actually didn't even prepare any stamping. That's horrible. So we're just gonna do a quick, Let's do this little puppy, because I do love me doggies. This is the Trick or Tweet stamp set. If you don't have that one, it's so cute. Good one to have in your arsenal. Okay, and we're going to grab something to stamp on. Let's see, here we go. This one looks smaller smaller than my current circle it is so we're just going to stamp the top of this little puppy dog I just wanted to grab something I already had cut out I keep lots of um, die cuts on hand that are from other projects and look how cute he is gosh darn it oh it makes me think of my Truvy being in the doctor's Okay, so we're just gonna do some down and dirty quick coloring here. I've got my light soft suede, and I'm just gonna color my puppy that whole color. Soft suede. Okay. And then kind of the color of Miss Trudy, actually. Oh, she'll be fine, I know. Deborah says, think positive. She will be totally fine. She's probably just got a little eye infection. I'm sure I'm, it's gonna be super fun to have to put drops in her eyeball. Lovely. Looking forward to that. Okay, so this is the dark Highland Heather. So I'm going to start with my darks. If you've ever watched my Stampin' Blends coloring, you know that this is always how I, I always start with the dark and then I use the light. So I start with the dark wherever I want it shadowed. Do, do, do. And then I go in with the light. All right. So we're gonna go over here and just color the light and blend it into the dark and it's beautiful. Oh, I just love the way that looks. Okay, so that is our puppy and I think he needs a nose, right? So let's grab, whoops, good grief, I'm throwing stuff. I'm going to leave a little white spot on his nose so it looks like he's got a little glimmer on his nose there. Okay, and then we're just going to add a few more dimensionals. Oh, 
Oh, that's awesome. Cindy says, I love these markers better than any I own. They are so easy to use, aren't they? I love that there's just a light and a dark and there's no fuss, no muss. Okay, so there it is. And then you just take your candies and stuff them in there or whatever you want to put in there. That's it. Isn't that adorable? Love it. Love it. That is it for today, folks. Thanks so much for hanging out with me and joining me. If you are watching this on the replay, all you have to do is touch the screen where the video is. It'll bring up the description. That's where all the links are to purchase the items you've seen here today. You can also um, make sure you print and download um, my, um, or download and print, my lovely or Love and Stampin' Rewards punch card. Um, you want to make sure you do that so that you can track your orders and then you can turn them in for free product from me. $40 in free product. That's a lot. All right. Thanks so much for hanging out with me. I will see you guys again on Thursday. Talk to you soon. Bye.